They are opera's next generation. The Canadian Opera Company's ensemble studio in final dress rehearsal for its public performance of Cossi Fantute. In the orchestra pit, three young musicians taking part in the first ever COC Orchestra Academy. We train young singers, young Canadian singers. Why shouldn't we equally train young Canadian musicians? The pilot program is in collaboration with the Glenn Gould School at the Royal Conservatory of Music and the Music Department at U of T. Well, this is a pilot project here. The idea for it was driven largely by the musicians themselves. The students are paired up with a member of the COC, a musical mentor. We listen to how they're playing uh, and, um, you know, maybe talk a little bit about phrasing, uh, dynamics, length of notes, little nuances, um, you know, about, about the music. It's good for them because they can watch us and maybe learn a few tricks of the trade. I learned a lot about opera. It's, it's a different game than symphonic playing because there, there's the stage you have to worry about. Expect the unexpected. The conductor is, of course, giving you the cues, but the conductor is also following what's happening on stage. Uh, so much more, your radar just has to be much more, uh, you have to be much more aware of what's going on all the time. The COC's been developing singers in its ensemble studio since 1980. The program's expanded to include an annual competition, Think American Idol for Opera. The new Academy for Music Students is just hitting its first few notes. But the mentors here agree the exposure to opera strikes a positive chord. To play in front of, it's a big deal in front of all of us, you know, it's, it's a big deal. I think it's fantastic. And all signs point to an expansion of the Academy in the future. Okay. Debbie Lytle-Kwan, CBC okay. News, Toronto.